Hello everybody, this is Xenocat823543, welcoming you back to Let's Play Singleblade Chronicles. And I just got Drive Boost, which is in something that I wanted because I already had Tantrum. The ones you want are Tantrum and this one, which is Battle Eye. Those are the two art books you want. But because I had Tantrum, I got Drive Boost. The other one, Air Fang, is a repeat. But it's annoying fighting this guy, because every single time you end up, like, in a battle against one of these, with, like, all of the other mech on in the room. It's kind of annoying. So, I have a lot of random materials. I think there's a landmark at the top of this, which is why I'm thinking about doing it there. There's this path over here that doesn't lead anywhere because it just goes towards the storage depot. But doesn't get to the storage depot. And then there's this elevator. Which we will use it because we want to get a little bit further in the central factory because we need to get further. Like, we need to actually make some decent progress in here. We've been in this, like, control tower area for so long. We might as well actually... We should actually move on. Well, I mean, we have the central warehouse lift. We just hit a landmark. So, now that we've hit a landmark, I'm going to go back to, and get those. And just quickly grab the crystals that we want. You know why I'm... The ether crystals that we want, because I still need to get enough agility of fives for everyone. Oh, but while we're doing this, I should probably say, I know I said earlier in this LP that I'm doing this mostly for myself, which is kind of true. But that's not saying that I don't appreciate every subscriber, every everyone who even watches these. Like every. Are you kidding me? Sorry, not about. But every time someone comments or likes or subscribes, it just. It motivates me so much. And my inventory is full. I love this. This is what you get to do when your inventory is full. Throw two things together. Craft them. I'm gonna do this a few times. Just I'm all over that. Speed this up. But Yay, two fall defense fives. I don't care about fall defense. But Yeah, but I really do appreciate every time anyone subscribes or likes or whatever. Or comments. And I do, if you comment, I will read it. I read every comment. Which I'm sure you know by now. All these first attack pluses. Okay, that fever was a bit unnecessary, I mean... <laughs> uh, but this is very boring, I know. But sometimes you have to do this. I don't even care what gems I'm crafting, I'm just crafting stuff that will, that's good together. And just trying to get stuff out I'm of this inventory. <laughs> and just try to trying to put stuff into the other inventory. I think that should be good. I got rid of six spaces. I opened up six spaces. I think I'll get five or six crystals, probably. So that's good. Okay. And eventually my gem inventory will fill up, I know. Because that can happen. I think it's getting close to full. At which point I'll probably sell off all the like, 
low rank 1 gems, except for AP up and EXP up, maybe. I don't know if I'll sell off the EXP up. I might. I don't really like EXP up that much, because I'm overleveled as is. I mean, there is a period in the game where you're underleveled, or you can get underleveled later on, even. So I might start selling stuff, so I might want it then, which is why I'm not going to sell it probably, but I'll sell like the rank 1 and rank 2 stat boosting stuff, because I know we'll never use those. Let's craft with whatever's most recent in the rank 4s. Oh, thanks for giving me a bunch of rare stuff. I didn't want any rare crystals. But every single one has agility up combined with something else. This is awful. I hate it when this happens. So now I'm going to get to like heat. Because I want Melia and Charla or Fiora? Fiora. Just to improve the chances of medium flame. I should get a lot of party sure. bonuses anyway. No problem. I don't even care about fall defense, I'm just glad I got the agility up there. But that's going to do it for gem crafting in this video. Got one more agility up, five. Uh, finally. That's out of the way, I should equip that on someone. Who's next? Ricky, probably, maybe Fiora. Well, how are stats? Agility, 156, 169. Fiora, oh no, Fiora has like, yeah, Fiora doesn't need it. Oh uh, yeah, throw that away. I'm probably gonna sell off like these fall defense gems, cause they're going to be pretty valuable. And I'm never going to use fall defense gems, ever. I'll probably get rid of all the stuff that doesn't affect battles, probably, except maybe Quick Step. Because I can see me, because I can see myself maybe using Quick Step. But the way I play gems should really only affect the battle. They shouldn't affect anything else. And I mean, the Quick Step gems, yes, for the one. Ice, for the ice stuff on Valak Mountain, I can see why they're useful, but everything else that doesn't affect the battle system, like, that wouldn't be helpful in the middle of a battle, I'm basically going to be selling. Okay. I know there's a giant fortress unit in this area, so that's why I'm being a little bit cautious. Also, there are a couple unique monsters, I think, in this general area. Oh, I think I got, I think I got new collectibles, too. So let's check on those. Yeah, I have the entire Collectopedia done. Cool. Prism Centipede. My gem inventory is full. Manage items, because that's going to be more valuable than something. I guarantee. Sale price. Let's throw that away. Oh. Manage items. This is what I was talking about. I predicted it. And parts mobile, which I found. Art heal, manage items. Because something. Yeah, because really. And for area complete, I get a Machina Driver 3. At least it's not another gem. But now my gem inventory is full, which is wonderful. So basically, I need to go on a selling spree where I'm going to be selling every gem that I don't care about a whole lot. Oh, and here's a unique monster. Cool. 
We'll come back to him later. Because I need to do stuff. Because I'm going to go sell those gems now. This will probably take a while, actually, because gems. And I'm going back to the Makano Refuge only because I feel bad about making this walk back to anywhere further, further away. Let's sell gems. Because we need to free up space. Let's see. Let me just scroll through them. Arts heal, I might never use those. I might use them. I don't know. Fall defense. I will never use fall defense. Weapon use gems, I'm almost all going to use, so... Field. Field. I don't care about field gems. Auto heal up. Go away. Terrain defense. I'm never going to use those. Quick step. I might actually use those. So I'm going to save the quick steps. Fall defense. I'm never going to use those. Aerial cloak. No, I'll never use the cloak gems either. Even though I did get some pretty good earth cloaks. Actually, I should have kept those. Oh well, I'll trade for them maybe. I might use an earth cloak at some point. Oh well. Eh, no, probably not. Anything rank 2 or below that's stat boosting, I'm gonna get rid of. Because honestly, I know I will never use anything rank 2 or below from now on. And if it's stat boosting. Probably debuff resists rank 2 or below, I'm never gonna use either. That I might use. These I might use. I might use that. I'll never use these blaze attacks. I'm just doubt it. The mics I might use, initial time tunes I might use. I don't know, use aggro up two. That's bad. I'm never gonna use that. Oh, this is awful. It keeps getting dragged off. Sorry about that. Oh, sorry about this. I'm adjusting stuff on camera. HP up two is never gonna use those. Again. Spike defense two, probably won't use. I'm just going to sell all my all these low ranking gems except for a few that I want to keep, like the AP ups. Recovery up twos, why would I use those? Horror heal twos, I don't care. Art heal two, not gonna use that. So many ether ups. Why would I use an ether up two if I have an ether up fives? I might use no, I won't use double attack twos. Days and Pierce resist twos, never gonna use those. Someone's actually using paralysis two. Debuff gems, I'm gonna keep all of them. Lightning attack twos, I won't keep. Back attack plus, I won't keep that. Rank, rank two. Walk on resist, throw those rank twos away. I know this is boring. I get it. Bind, okay, that's good. Chill attack, go away. Auto attack stealth, I don't need those. Oh, these are all the agility ups I have. I mean, I'm never going to use threes for this ever again. So I might as well sell any agility up three, two, or one. Because basically I'm going to have everyone with one agility up four and Oh, no, don't sell the topple resist. That's a good topple resist. These are bad topple resists. Get rid of twos. Basically, twos and ones, I'm going to be... Actually, that's my only haste gem. I'm going to keep it. Break two, I might keep... I'm going to keep just because it's a debuff. 
and I'm making a set exceptions for debuffs, I know, but stability, attack stability, I don't really care about that much. Attack plus, get rid of all these. Critical up to, oh well, I sold that, whatever. I don't really care about critical up. So I tech two, I don't need. Just get the tech two, no, I don't need that. Deep up plus two. That's my only deep up plus gem. I'll keep it. Poison attack, we need to get rid of. And that cleared up a lot of space. I'm sorry that took so long, but we cleared up like two pages for gems. I'd say that was worth it. And we get to the central warehouse lift. We can go right there. No. Uh, right at the top of the lift. There's the fortress unit. I want to stay out of that things way. Things way. I'm gonna fight synchronized Gaurus in this episode, and we'll call it an episode after that fight. So let's fight this guy. This won't take long. Leave this to me. I feel my power is he has to fight synchronized Gaurus on his one sidekick. Oh my god. Yeah, I think we've basically destroyed synchronized Gaurus already. Confused. Just so many debuffs all at once. Oh, I might as well boost that. Oh, here, have ice. Lag. Oh, the fortress unit is attacking me, whatever. I'll deal with it. I think that's probably the biggest threat right now that I can ignore. Okay, that's the actual unique monster itself. There goes the offensive diary that accompanied it. And now let's take on a fortress unit at ground level. This guy is actually our level. You get to see the effects of agility ups on Ricky and Ryan. Gumban does not have an agility up, but he has naturally high agility. See, all of the auto attacks are missing. This is why it's so good. You can do so much with agility. That's probably going to do some damage. Let's try to take something. He's getting damaged out. Let's heal Ryan up. So she can deal with some dam damage with Black Matter. That's the really big one. Also this one. This art, which being on a ledge is the only thing that would benefit that. That'll deal a lot of damage to everyone. So I'd be a little bit worried about that. Except now it'll miss. So I wouldn't worry about it now. Also, we can just confuse him. That'll help. And, come on. Mega Flamethrow. Oh, this art. Yeah, this other art the Fortress units have. That looks bad. I'm gonna use this chain attack just for the sake of getting his health up a bit. 
and then getting some good damage done with Dunban. Yes, the whole combo. Line, uh, yeah, let's keep getting more damage. In. Not a whole lot, but. Heal us both. And I need to get the party gate back up just in case. Yeah. And that's not good. Titan laser. Yay. All of his variety of attacks. This isn't the unique monster. It's funny that the non-unique monster is harder than the unique monster that we just caught. Then again, there's a unique one of these guys who is level 70. Needless to say, I won't be taking him on yet in the near future. Oh, it's going to miss? Why do you even need to warn me about that? I'm totally fine with that feature. Or he could just die. That too. The fight's over, wow. We got the fortress unit down. Quickly going to collect that drop. Grab this. By the way, press that. That turns this central lift on. It take, it's a shortcut back to the beginning of the area. But do press it. And next time, we're going to farm for our books from Synchronized Galarus. See you then.